Hello friends, welcome back to our channel Footech360. In this video, we are solving TNMRB Food Safety Officer Exam Mock Test Set 3. Link for Set 1 and Set 2 has given in the description. So without any further delay, let's get started. Question number 1. Head Office of Akmak is located at Options A. New Delhi B. Chennai C. Haryana D. Kolkata Correct answer C. Haryana Question number 2. Which of the following covers under agreement on technical barrier to trade? Options A. Guarantees quality B. Prevents fraud C. Prevents the environment D. All of them Correct answer D. All of them Question number 3. As per first schedule, section 5, clause number 1, Indian states are divided into how many zones? Options A, 2, B, 4, C, 5, D, 6. Correct answer, C, 5 zones. Question number 4. ISO 22000 deals with? Options A, QMS, B, FSMS, C, EMS, D, NABL. Correct answer B. FSMS Question number 5 While storing non-perishable items in the dry food store, which one of the following is incorrect? Options A. Keep the storage area clean, cool, dry and airy B. Store grains in the bins with well-fitted lids and a separate scoop C. Place closed sacks of grains directly on the floor D. Store food on the racks well above floor level and away from the wall Correct answer C. Place closed sacks of grains directly on the floor. Question number 6. As per food fortification regulations, which statement is incorrect? Options A. Fortified processed food should be provide 15 to 30 percent RDA of micronutrients. B. The form of iron used for fortification should be hemi iron. C. HFSS foods are excluded from fortified processed foods category. D. Only micronutrients are used for purpose of food fortification. Correct answer. B. The form of iron used for fortification should be hemi iron. Question number 7. A dry, grainy and brownish discoloration seen on frozen meat and poultry is called? Options A. Freezer burn. B. Dehydro freezing. C. Freeze drying. D. Sharp freezing. Correct answer A. Freezer burn Question number 8 Which of the following are non-food allergens? Options A. Sugar B. Rice milk C. Tapioca D. Barley Correct answer D. Barley Question number 9 The recommended strength of chlorinated water used for sanitizing heavily soiled vegetables should not exceed Options A. 50 ppm B. 100 to 200 ppm C. 75 ppm D. 500 ppm Correct answer B. 100 to 200 ppm Question number 10 Which of the following are mycotoxins? Options A. Deoxyne valinol B. Fumonescence C. Both A and B D. None of these Correct answer C. Both A and B Question number 11 In bread, bacillus subtilis causes Options A. DK B. Rotting C. Ropiness D. Pigmentation Correct answer C. Ropiness Question number 12. Which of the following bacteria is involved in vinegar manufacture? Options A. Pseudomonas B. Glucanobacter C. Alkalogens D. All of the above Correct answer B. Glucanobacter Question number 13. For the canning of most food products, dash cans are used. Options A. Copper B. Glass C. Iron D. Tin Correct answer D. Tin Question number 14. The most common sugar used in soft drinks. Options A. High fructose corn syrup B. Sucrose C. Maltose D. Lactose Correct answer A. High fructose corn syrup Question number 15. Radiation is the transfer of heat by means of Options A. Electrical wave B. Electromagnetic wave C. Magnetic wave D. None of the options Correct answer 
B. Electromagnetic wave. Question number 16. Which of the following systems involve the immobilization of photosensitive chemical onto a substrate? Options A. Ultrasound B. Pulsed light C. Ultrasonic cutters D. Photodynamic Correct answer D. Photodynamic Question number 17. Muscle tissue contains around dash percentage of proteins. Options A. 25 B. 35 C. 10 D. 19 Correct answer D. 19 Question number 18. Predominant anti-nutritional factor in raw soybean. Options A. Hemagglutinin B. Saponins C. Trypsin inhibitors D. All of the options Correct answer C. Trypsin inhibitors Question number 19. Which tests are used to determine if there is any difference between or among the samples? Options A. Sensitivity test B. Descriptive test C. Rating test D. Difference test Correct answer C. Writing test Question number 20 Baked products can be tested for moisture level by conducting Options A. Farinogaf test B. TSS test C. Baker's gel meter test D. Wettability test Correct answer D. Wettability test Food Tech 360 is providing an MCQs plan for TNMRB Food Safety Officer as per the syllabus which includes topic-wise important MCQs as per the syllabus which covers around 2200 plus MCQs along with that you will get access to join our telegram private group for daily quiz till the exam all MCQs are provided in PDF format through mail after payment we have made a separate video on explaining all the details of this MCQs plan link for that has given in the description kindly check the description box and comment section to know the complete details of this MCQs plan and for payment details you can download the sample copy of this MCQs plan from our telegram channel, link is in the description. Or you can directly contact us through WhatsApp for further queries and sample copy. So that's all for this video, don't forget to subscribe to our channel, Footech360. Thank you.